So, I've totally stolen this idea from Rebecca, who is the pigeon's nest, but we now have a visual timetable for our day, and an arrow pointing out where we are, and for mummy, we have Teen Tom, because, yeah, this house is slowly getting more and more messy, so I need to get back to where we were. So this one has been doing some learning and she's now allowed to do some Playtime Island on my iPad. She loves using my iPad because it's a huge screen. Um, but we have got some colour sorting and some numbers and uh, a little um, shape scavenger hunt to do once I've finished making us some lunch. Basically, I woke up this morning going, do you know what, you need to get out of this funk, Sophie, because y you just do. <laughs> <laughs> the one thing we are missing at the moment is we're missing the morning calls with school. I need to put that on the list, actually. Um, so 8.15 to 8.30 is nursery slot. Um, and it's just like a typed thing, but it's it's quite nice, really. So um, we need to do that. And then there's bedtime story as well, which school is putting on for us, um, I think, every night in the, in the um, holidays, which is nice. Um, school haven't been that great at communicating what they're offering and I know this has kind of caught them on the hop but I would expect more um, from a fee paying school and we're not really so it's a little bit, un I'm a little bit unimpressed but everyone's basically flying by the seat of their pants so okay um, anyway so we need to decrease the amount of screen time use the um, green pen on my finger. <laughs> That's whiteboard marker. Um, yeah, we need to increase the amount of screen time and we need to actually have some structure to our day because both of us aren't doing very well without structure. So, and it means that when she's, say, having a snack and screen time, um, I can be getting on with either some cleaning and some tidying or um, doing some emails for tutoring or editing because I really, like... At this point in time, I think I'm about four days behind on my edits for the vlog, so I need to get those done. Um, so yeah, after, during, after lunch, we'll probably have a bit of screen. Yes, darling. No, darling. Should we have some lunch? Do you want to help me make lunch? Yeah, we'll have a bit of early lunch. Come on then. We've only just bought Amelia this dress from Next, and it's been washed once. And I can't decide whether that's been eaten or been caught on something. Either way, I have blue thread. I'm going to darn it. Well, I'm not going to darn it. I think I'm just going to close up the hole because it's just it's just a cheap jersey dress. So it doesn't really matter if it needs to look a bit beautiful. So, And then I'm going to take these two pillowcases and I'm going to unpick the tops or some of the tops to create a hole in the opening so that I can um, I'm probably gonna hand stitch them to be honest because there's no point in getting my sewing machine on just for creating a hole for ribbon closure although actually I might get my sewing machine out just to do the um, top stitching round but otherwise these are gonna be made into laundry bags today and sent off to another friend's sister Hello, 
Are you enjoying rooting through my lo- Mommy, my, my we sewing need box? A heart. I can't. I don't know if there is a heart, baby girl. Should we look underneath the trays? Yes. Okay. So, excuse the glasses, screen work, I'm, a, I'm editing the, uh, I'm just gonna take them off. Um, I'm editing the vlog, but while I do it, um, so I'm on 1st of April now, um, while I do it, I've been winding some yarn for the new Tina Say Knits, Tina Say Knits um, mystery knit along that starts today. Um, so it's a three colour shawl, and I put some photos up on in my Instagram stories for, to people, for people to vote, and now I'm going with a completely different colour and different set of colours anyway, um, because that's me. But I've, um, I've just been winding up some, um, I think it's Studio Donegal, I can't even find the blooming tag now. Uh, oh, here we go, Studio, Studio Don- Donegal Darnie, which actually I got free as part of my press pack. Um, for Woolen last year, which has now been cancelled for this year. I wasn't planning on going anyway, but um, but yeah, it's beautiful. It's 100% lamb's wool um, in this kind of dark teal colour. Uh, but the fluff that's from me winding, taking, winding this from my skein wind, my... Let's show you. Yeah. Anyway, from going from my Swift, there we go, my Swift to my yarn winder. I have a Knit Pro um, wooden yarn winder, which makes the most beautiful cakes, um, and a Amish style um, Swift uh, from Sunflower Swifts, who are no longer making anymore. But literally, I don't know if you'll be able to see this. Well, you might be able to see it on the um, on the paper, but there is fluff everywhere now. It's just dust, wool dust everywhere. I don't think you can see it very well, but oh my god. <laughs> There's, no, no, there we go, I've just moved, I literally moved my, um, moved some stuff and it just created this giant dust bunny. So, um, yeah, my keyboard is just, there, covered. <laughs> so I'm now, I'm now gonna have to dust. But yeah, I'm editing, beautiful angle. Um, I'm editing 1st of April right now, so I'll have three load, three vlogs up hopefully by the end of this session. Hello. Oh, Buzzy Bumblebee. 